your trainer did his part, your parents did their part, your coaches, whatever team you play on, did their part. Now what are you going to do? Um, I'm from Baltimore. Bino, Bino's from Baltimore. He's a coach at Maryland. So it's a, it's a good feeling to get back to the city of Baltimore, help Bino with his camp, uh, help these little kids learn, learn the game of basketball. Uh, Just here to help the kids, you know, making making them vision something else like bigger than basketball. Be here, be able to help them, you know. Seeing us here means a lot to them, not just to them, but also to us. You know, it's a really important day, helping them, helping them doing little things. Obviously, they see us playing college basketball. They wish they could be at that level. So for us to be here means a lot to us. He keeps the ball. If he don't score, the defense get the ball to the next guy on. We got. It. Um, this is my eighth year doing it, and this is something that I have a lot of pride and I take a lot of, uh, I have a lot of passion in, in doing it. Um, it's for the kids, it's, it's a free event, and what, what we want to give the kids today is basic fundamentals. I, I strongly believe that that's something that's being left out of the game today, especially without, without youth. I was very important um, because a lot of the kids we look up to us as role models and they, they try to emulate us in every way. So like, why not try to help them out the way we would help them when we were younger? It's very important for the guys to be able to see guys like Bruno Fernando, Jalen Smith, and Daryl Morsell because, you know, it, it gives them hope. It gives them hope and, and then you can learn their story and learn their journey and, and then, then, you know, they can actually aspire to be where, where they're at today. I've been to places in this, in this world I never dreamed about going to. All over the 50 states, all over the world because of basketball. Free education, a job doing something I love. You can, oh, you can attain all those things through the game. If you work on your game two hours from this point in your life till you graduate in high school, you'll get a scholarship. Now, to balance the scale, we gotta put two hours into our academics also. We heard that before, we got to balance the scale. So what I'm saying is, to make a long story short, is you have to value this ball, value the game. Sam Cassell once told me this, if you cheat the game, the game's going to cheat you. Now basketball... I would like to thank all the people who contributed to being a little dribblers today. Your support is very well appreciated. Thank you. Go Beano Little Dribblers. Thank you, Jimmy Seafood.